All right, it's supposed to be a nice day today. Right now it's 32 degrees, but it's supposed to get up to 40. No wind, which is awesome. It's uh, not really fun to be outside when the wind's blowing 50, 60 miles an hour and it's freezing. So I'm gonna be working on clearing the land. Uh, the previous seller had cut down a bunch of trees to get the view, which is amazing. I'll show you that to you. Um, but yeah, I've been working on this for the last few months since I bought this place. I uh, moved in last September in 2022. So um, yeah, it's a lot of work, but I love it. It's fun. And just one of the many projects I got to get done, hopefully by summer. So I'll show you what I'm working on. So this is the, the view. And there were a whole bunch of trees in the way, apparently, but it's stunning. You know, those are the Sisters Mountains, uh, the volcanic range there. And there's a whole bunch of trees that were cut down and just left. And, you know, you can see my wood pile from uh, trees that I've pulled over and cut up, and I'll keep doing that. Um, but, you know, I got 10 acres out here and a lot of trees. <laughs> so, but I'm going to take advantage of the, of the nice weather and get something done today, hopefully. All right, so I'm walking out where the trees are. This is my burn pit. This is where I've been burning all the branches and uh, logs or whatever that are too small for firewood. Um, these are some of the trees I still need to cut up and take over to the chop pile. But as I work, you know, walk back here, you'll see all these trees. Um, yeah, here's one I cut up, <clears throat> tried to get the, the stump down, you know, as close to ground level as possible, but I ain't too worried about it. Um, anyway, there's some bigger ones out here, but, um, I'm just going to head back here. I guess there's probably, whew, I want to say 20 or 30 trees that were cut down. You see a big mess here. Um, you know, I've been going through and like this stuff here, I could, I could pull over to the brush pile um, and burn it. Um, but I've been going through and cutting up what I can't pull. There's a good log right there I need to cut up. <clears throat> so anyway, yeah, see that's a little too big to pull with my four-wheeler, so I'm gonna cut that one up. There you go. All the rest of this, I'll grab with the four wheeler and pull it over to the burn pile. All right, now I've got a bunch of logs that I can pull over to my burn pit. So I'm gonna go grab the four wheeler, make, make that an easier, fun part of it. I mean, I, when I started, I was pulling it all manually by hand and just, there's just so much out there. So, or well, it was a lot more fun. Anyway, so let's go in the shed here, get the four wheeler. It's my beast. It's my Can Am. All right, here we go. So I got a nice little road back here. Just for uh, land work. Flip around here. So there's 
burn pit and pull all the logs over to it. So basically I'm just gonna grab them with the rope I got. So I spent the last two hours using my four-wheeler to pull all the, well, not all, but a large chunk. It just feels like I made a small dent. But I got all that pulled into the burn pit. Um, it's gonna be quite the bonfire when it's all said and done. I gotta go through and cut out all the big logs like that one and this big guy here so try to get this down to just branches and uh, save the big stuff like this for firewood so work in progress but i'm getting there <laughs> 